Uh, now, I gotta take care of those barrels, too. Uh, Murasame. Let me, let me chill a little bit with Murasame. You know what? We're gonna use resist right here. Fuck it. What'd he say? Dig? Huh? Speak up, Murasame. Speak up, boy. Mumbling and shit. Aspia Mage is not going to move. Okay, I really anticipated the Aspia Mage coming into play. Uh, so you know what that means. With the giant armors gone, and just that Aspia Mage, I could go fuck his ass up. And no Dominion, right? Wow, seven, impressive. That Bow Knight not really doing much, and you're gonna go for Symbios, of course. This is why you give all of your power-up items to Symbios, is so he becomes a one-man wrecking crew. The world-class wrecking crew has never heard of someone as incredible as Symbios right now. Uh, Irene. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do with Irene? I'm gonna go ahead and toss a Tornado 3 on both of these fuckers, so that way the next two people who come in and attack them, they'll be building up friendship with Irene. Yes, yes. Also, I might have Murasame uh, run forward and take care of all of those barrels, which he could with his uh, blaze too. Uh, Wilmer has an unknown level of strength to me, right? Well, Symbios can't one-shot the Aspia Mage, can he? I'm trying to think. Phoenix 2? Rise, Phoenix. Let's see how you handle this as the Phoenix rises. Rise, Phoenix. And you're dead. Goodbye. Thanks for playing. Uh, healing drop. Uh, we will not pick that up, because nothing we can do with that. Okay, Dantares. Uh, Wilmer has a sword. So we'll put Dantares right here, and we'll attack this Silver Knight. Prepare to die. That's pretty good, Dantares. I like it. Okay, Maskerin. You know what? Fuck it. Just die. Just just go to hell. Both of you just be gone. Be gone. Teamwork, baby. Or as Kakashi would say, Teamwaku. Okay, Khan. Uh, you know what Khan could do? Evil Ring. Although I don't think it would kill this Silver Knight. Uh, the Evil Ring spark is not that powerful. Yeah. But a little bit of damage, you know, to the other Bow Knight. Now we could definitely, like, uh, kill him. So, whatever. It's fine. Okay, Sybil... Yeah, okay. Uh, we'll have Sybil head over this way. Eldar can take you out. What a fucking easy fight this turns out to be. Hey, Wilmer, remember all that shit you were talking? Yeah. How'd that turn out again? Oh, right. Right, that turned out great for you, huh? Turned out fucking swell for you, huh? What's, uh... Yeah, Murasame's at level 2 uh, ninjato. It's not surprising there. Alright, so we'll go ahead and take care of the three barrels. Disappear! Disappear! I like that. 
Like, if I was going to cast, like, this type of magic right here, I guess I would tell, you know, disappear. Large mithril. There we go. Nice 15 experience for Murasame. Kerbal ammo. Uh, looks like Hayward is not going to do jack fucking shit in this battle. Alright, so here's the Bow Knight. Going for Eldar, I see. Smart move. That should do a little damage. Yeah, 11. Not bad. Not bad. Because Eldar is a flying. Whoa! You're not going, huh? Eldar is a flying character, so she takes extra damage from the Bow Knight. Should I make sure Symbios kills Wilmer? Yeah, I think so, you know. The boy was talking a little bit of smack, and uh, I didn't really appreciate that so much. So, I'm gonna have to give him the business. That's, uh, that's what's gonna happen here. Okay, Khan. Khan will walk over here and bitch slap him. Fist the Fury. I like it. Wow. Wow. That did more than I thought it was gonna. What the fuck? So, evidently, Wilmer talks big, but, uh... He can't really back that shit <laughs> Not at all. Hey, remember when you attacked me? Let me show you how it's done, Mr. Bonite. Zero count? Oh, come on. Eldar. You need to nuke him into oblivion. Alright, so uh, we'll finish the battle on Symbios' next turn. Uh, actually, I do need to build up uh, Dantarius with his lances. He still has not reached level 3 lance. Very surprising about that. I mean, he has got to be a stone's throw away from it, though. Uh, Sybil, she's not building up any weapons or anything. Whatever, just kind of stand back there. Grace, uh... Sure, let's use Aura 2. Why not? Just so Grace could do something in this fight. There you go, Symbios. Uh, Marissa, you know what? I'm actually, uh... 31 defense... We're going to keep uh, Murasame a little back here. Uh, this boy, not quite uh, up to snuff. I'll go ahead and use a resist right here. Maybe build up some uh, friendships. Why not? Hayward. Oh boy. Standing right next to Symbios. Yeah, Wilmer would die. But I can't even hit him, so. Uh, going for Symbios. I like it. I like it. Wow. Uh. Okay. Alright, is, is that your final move? Are you sure that is your final move? Okay. Uh, no. Irene wouldn't kill him. She's not gonna do 80. Yeah. <laughs> Please get Mirage Dance Symbios. Uh, can I get a crit bonus? Well, if I stood next to Hayward. Uh, this will give a luck bonus. Yeah! Remember that shit you were talking, boy? Yeah, what? Omni slash your ass the fucking hell. Oh, became soulmates with Irene. Let's go. Let's go! One more soulmate for Symbios. Yeah! Yeah, it's- Oh, damn. I guess- Guess I shouldn't have been talking shit. Alright, so Murasame did actually come in quite handy there. Yeah, uh, Wilmer, why did you do that? 
Okay, so he's scared for the Republic, all right. Oh, shit. So the Empire has already occupied Aspia. What the fuck? Yeah, how the fuck did this happen? Tell us. Oh, okay, so Aaron's forces from the Empire, an army from the Bolsum sect. Okay, so as long as Mallory doesn't help, they won't kill Symbios' nephew. Okay, so basically he's telling us, go handle business without the Mallory army's help. Yeah, so it looks like Wilmer wasn't in league with the Empire or the Balsam sect. He was doing that to protect Algeron. Uh, okay, so Tristus, I see. Tristus was like, fuck you, Braff. Are you a child? I am not going to back down. I'm going to fight the Imperials and fight the Balsam sect. Fuck this shit. And then Wilmer locked up Tristus to protect Algeron because Tristus was ready to sacrifice his son for the greater good. I see. Okay. So Wilmer was not evil. Okay, Braff is right outside the city. Uh, we need to beat him before we can free Tristus. Yeah. Yeah. Tristus is like, he, he's a, an honorable lord, and he's like, you know what? The needs of the many outweigh the needs of the few. I understand. Okay, so Murasame's gonna go tell everyone, hey, Will <laughs> Murasame, it's ninja teleports, man. Uh, okay, so let's go crush the Braff army. Alright. And now we're at the Mallory Courtyard. Guess what? We destroyed those barrels, kids. You know what that means. Teresa time. Okay, so. Here we have three absolutely delicious treasures. If I could ever fucking... Symbio, stop fucking with me. There we go. Uh, we get a dark matter. Eh. Eh. Uh, here we get the gun gear. Uh, that is Dantares' best lance. And we get the Macho Mace. That is the best weapon for Horse. Uh, okay, so we could just have Dantares just fucking equip the gun gear. Uh, okay, so up three. And it has a special attack. It's actually a really good one. It's called uh, Death Charge. Yep, Death Charge. And uh, it could fucking one-shot anybody. And let me go, well, it, it, it's, it can utterly destroy an opponent. Right, right. Horus isn't in the party, so I can't give him the Macho Mall just yet. Uh, okay, so let's go ahead and search the rest of the castle. There is still actually uh, quite a few treasures here. Uh, all right, so I actually want to... Aha, here we go. What's up, fool? Uh, Finding is locked up right now. Uh, he's very close to Lord Tristus, so they don't want to release him. Tell us about the situation. Okay. Uh, yep, so Murasame very quickly told all of the castle guards everything. And I believe we have something right here. A uh, large mithril. Nice, nice. Finding, hello! Uh, Finding, obviously, by his portrait and stuff, he, there's a chance he might join us later on. Oh, Wilmer's betrayed. I didn't know that. It's a good thing you told us. It's a really good thing you told us, Finding. I I mean, who, whoever could have guessed that? Oh, right. We already killed him. So, we, we got it. We got it. Thanks. Thanks, though. A little late, Finding, but uh, thank you. All right. I believe there is a treasure room over her. Oh, excuse me, old timer. And what do we got? A uh, pretty glove. Okay, that is for Irene. Uh, let's check and see what's better. The pretty glove or the 
Magna Carta Holy Grail glove. Okay, so here is a pretty glove. Okay, so that would lower her attack but raise her agility. Interesting. What are the other uh, stats for this? Okay, so a critical 10, counter 5 is what she's got. Oh, so, wow, okay. So the pretty glove lowers her attack and her critical rate? The pretty glove is not as good, is what that means. Okay, it's interesting, all right. <laughs> a little blown away by that, but that's life, what can you do? And I believe we have, is it, what the hell? I'm inside the barrel. No, no. Symbios don't live in the barrel. We hate barrels. Wait, isn't there a? I think I want to head uh, back over her. Got a little mix up. Oh, excuse me. And we get a lucky cookie. Okay, so the lucky cookies are important, but with what I want to do with the lucky cookie, I'm actually going to hold on to that, and I'm probably going to take that with me into scenario three before I decide exactly who I want to use it on, uh, because luck is going to be very important in the premium disc, because uh, there's a, actually a pretty tough boss who uh, inflects some really nasty poison on us in the premium disc. So I'm going to wait until then. Uh, this is basically the throne room for Tristus. 3,000 gold. Hey! Uh, without the two of them. Okay, so Braff is controlling shit. Uh, I believe that's Lady Margaret over there. And that's Lord Tristus. Okay, so... They're locked in the room. I see. They're waiting. Okay. Very smart. So we're going to keep it um, hidden from them until we take down Brath. Uh, which will be easy. Brath is a pussy. What do you guys got to say? Uh, oh, you don't know what it was, but I had a human form. A giant person exists with glowing red eyes. Hmm. Sounds like a boss. Okay, so uh, that w okay, so they saw a giant person, almost as though you could say a titan, perhaps. I see, and that would explain how Aspia, uh, Aspinia fell. That actually, oh, hello, I see that many bookshelves. That's got to have some interesting plot. Uh, two ways to enter Aspia Castle. No, please tell me more. Uh, the stone bridge in front, right? The catacombs. Oh. Fuck yeah, I know about the Way Center Aspia Castle. The Black Statue Gem. Okay. The other to the moat. That info will come in handy later, I promise. I promise, promise, promise. Uh, Valve was ever to be opened all the way. The power of the dam would be beyond imagination. I sense a dam battle similar to Bethlehem Garrison in Final Fantasy Tactics. Uh, may have been used to train soldiers. Yeah, they're talking about the heroes test right there. That's where we're going to be grinding our forces later on. Into what a gem might fit. Yes, we'll see that very soon. If they become overconfident, there is a weak point we could take advantage of. Ain't that the motherfucking truth? Uh, okay, so tons of hidden passages with the Espinia ruins, I see. Alright, so we got all the treasure in here. We might as well fuck off. What do you got to say? Uh, Wilmer's an excellent strategist, huh? Okay, so yeah, they're, they're like, holy shit, you guys were able to take out Wilmer. You guys are fucking bosses. Well, okay, he betrayed Lord Tristus, but it wasn't like... An evil betrayal. Because they are saving, you know, the prince, basically. It's, you know, a, a sticky situation. Okay, yeah, so 
Symbiosis sister, uh, she's not handling it very well either. That's life, though, girl. What can you do? Uh, let's head to the headquarters. Uh, no, we're not ready to go say hello to Brav quite yet. Oh, I'm getting turned around. There we go. Uh, okay, so Murasame is now a member of our delicious force. Huh. You know, I kind of... Okay, let me take a look at this here, because... I think... This will probably be our force in the last battle here in Scenario 1. Just like this. Although, perhaps I should swap Khan and Hagane. You know, I might... You know, I think I might do that. Because the last time we used the Symbios army... Uh, this on the left is gonna be our force. We might swap Noon for Finding, though. But, uh, I don't... Am I... I'm not ready to get rid of Khan quite yet. Uh, Khan still has use to me. So I might just swap Murasame in for Hagane. Yeah. I'm thinking that's what we're gonna do. Uh, cause Murasame is a lot stronger than Hagane right now. Yeah, it's, it's almost shameful, actually. Sheesh, Murasama, er, Hagane. Uh, okay, so this is the force we'll be rocking for now. Uh, we'll, we'll bring Hagane with us into the hero's, uh, tomb, though. Okay, so Braff is not just doing this to avenge his father. He has another motive. Interesting. Uh, okay, so Braff was able to delay us enough time to where the Imperials were able to take control of Espinia. That does suck. Uh, yeah, someone purposely led us in circles. Yeah, we did basically run in a giant circle. Yep, Wilmer was not evil. He was trying to help out Tristus. Braff is formidable. You know, uh, Mursame's not wrong there. Braff, Braff is strong. Oh, wait, wait. An evil presence... Actually, I'm glad we keep talking to Khan and Frank, because they're letting us know when evil is around. But his actions could lead to the downfall of Aspia. Yeah, was Algeron's life worth the entire Republic? We'll see. Or a rogue faction. Oh, so Eldar's saying, is it possible this is just someone's doing by themselves in the Empire? So if we're defeated, the Republic dies. Gotcha. Thanks for the vote of confidence, Agane. And Noon is agreeing. Alright, so let's uh, definitely not lose then. Alright, what do you got to say, Ratchet? Uh, yes, actually this is true. We currently are on a no-death run. No characters have died, and that will continue. Uh, although, the two toughest battles to keep uh, everyone alive are still in front of us in Scenario 1. So, we haven't gone through the two toughest. Uh, dirty traitorous dog. Yeah, fuck Braff. What can I say? Fuck him. Fuck him up the ass. Yep. It's crazy. That's cray. Oh, damn that Braff. Oh, intense evil. That is interesting. Could it be Braff? We'll see. Must be motivated by their own sense of justice. Yeah, that's that's always how it is. Uh, good guy or bad guy? Who, Wilmer? Uh, Wilmer was a good guy. We go with a uh, good guy for Wilmer, for sure. 